this is Maryland Cross. You are watching the Big Dog Post Game Show, brought to you by Biner Four Gates and the Big Dog himself, Rick Jacklich at the Jacklich Law Group. <laughs> Seven Maryland win, season saver, Bruce. Yeah, Spanos was great down the wire, and the defense came up big when they had to. What a defensive stand for the season! Here you go. Saying that Logan, there's 46 seconds left. And that, it is. Um, it's last it was save a sloppy this. game, but guess what, Wayne? You're We're seven and three. Right. Another one goal win. One goal wins to find character in lacrosse. And when Maryland had to show its character, they did. But that turnover there where they had put a run out the first time. It's unbelievable we got a break. This shot from Ohio State was not a tough one for Logan, okay? It was not a tough one. But, you know, they had to shoot. They had to do something. But it was a great win. I mean, it's always tough with Ohio State. Well, Bruce, span us. Oh, what a goals. game. What a game. What a game. Well, we're going to be back with Senior Day stuff. We're going to be back at the press conference. So this is the first part of the post-game show. This is the Big Dog Post-Game Show. I'm Wayne. That's Bruce. We'll be back in a moment. Three, two, one. One, two, one. Turf Talk Post-Game Live. It's Eric Spanos. Bruce. Eric. Four goals a day, two big ones down the wire. That's why you came to Maryland. Yeah. That's why you're the guy. Tell us about both of those two goals, how they set up for you. Yeah, so I mean, you said it perfectly. You, you come to Maryland to play in games like this, like the Big Ten Conference is nothing to shy away from, but everyone is going to give Maryland their best shot. Since 1991, Viner Forgates has completed thousands of projects across the D.C. metro area and around the globe. Use Viner Forgates for your next IT project. Hey, Rick Jack, who's your favorite number one term? Stefan Diggs, DJ Moore. Really? Now, come on, you know, Rakeem Jarrett's always been my favorite number one. Hey, Rock Jarrett, who's your number one? The Rick Jacklish Law Group. Why? Awesome trial results, unbelievable customer service, plus you've taken great care of my mom over the last 20 years. Just some of the reasons that the Jacklish Law Group has been voted the number one personal injury trial firm in the entire USA. If you're hurt, call the Big Dogs. 855-BIG-DOG-1. McDonald. Running on the far side, just 10 seconds left as a penalty. Ryan Syracuse, deep right corner. Now no not shoot, they better off with the ball, that it up. Yeah, it's 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 and don't forget to stick around and honor our Maryland seniors with our Senior Day Ceremony starting shortly talk wrap it up we actually outlasted the music for once all right you got to talk to everybody you wanted to talk to i think yeah we got well we got the key key players it's such a big game i know you know people might have expected the, an easy win you knew it was i knew it. everybody did the coach knew it yeah. this was a battle and the team out battled ohio state by that much give them credit they gave it everything, but they just came up a little bit short. But you know we'll probably see him again. Well, you know, the, you've got the Big Ten tournament. You've got two games left. Both sort of feel local because they are. You've right. Rutgers here. You're at Hopkins. You still got to win them both? Are you going to win one of them? or how, how do Well, you that, your, your goal is to win them both and maybe tie. Yeah, and tie, at least tie for the Big Ten if Hopkins goes 4-1. and one. And uh, I don't know what's happened with Hopkins Penn State today, but that, that's going to play a big factor in it. But you know what? Just take games one at a time. Get in the dance. Uh, the Big Ten Championship is, is very important, but it's about the natty. 
and we're still alive. And that's the key thing. And I gotta tell you, at halftime of that Penn State game, I was really worried, really worried. But I think they carried that juice from last week into this game. And uh, when it mattered, Uno, numero Uno, came to play. He was fantastic. He had that strip and then the pass to the long You had a strip in the left corner you had, uh, with Colin down there with 24, yeah. and that turns into a goal. goal. It was unbelievable goal. And the, your long goals were unbelievable yeah. on offense today. Yeah, no. Right. It was, I mean, it was awesome. It's something we've kind of been preaching on. You know, every year it gets harder to score six on six. Teams are just so good nowadays. And uh, we feel like we got some guys that can really handle the ball and really shoot the ball really well. The whole goal by Jack McDonald gives the Terps the lead. Great play by Ajax and Sharky, just being able to get it up the field so fast. And then uh, just from there, it's just kind of you're reading a four on three break. Uh, they didn't slide and just let it fly. That was kind of and, and Logan and Eric and, and everybody got this. How about today. Luke? I don't know what his numbers were. He was he was really good today. He was great today. From the last quarter of that Penn State game through today, what a difference seven days makes. We'll get the press conference.